Well, a major pharmaceutical company is bringing millions of dollars to our area. Today, Eli Lilly announced that it is investing $1 billion for a new manufacturing plant in Cabarrus County. And we're hearing it's going to bring nearly 600 new jobs to Concord. The company says that the average pay is going to be 70 thousand dollars a year and leaders estimate that it's also going to bring 40 million dollars into the local economy every year. So if Eli Lilly sounds familiar to you, that's because you probably heard it on the news. It makes a lot of the common medications that we've talked about things like treating things like diabetes to depression, but also those monoclonal antibodies that treat COVID-19. And in fact, we mentioned it this week when we learned that the FDA had actually pulled emergency use for the drug because it found that it wasn't effective against the Omicron variant. So the company says this 800,000 square foot plant in Concord is going to produce injectable products. It's going to include a manufacturing facility, packaging space, quality control lab as well. Take a listen. Your investment balances our population growth. Our community will benefit from new jobs and added tax revenue, which will help pay for the services that keep us safe and improve our quality of life. Now, leaders expect to break ground on the facility later this year. They also say that in it of itself is going to create more jobs, another 500 construction jobs, in fact. And you might recall, too, this is just the latest company interested in setting up shop in Concord in the area. Kroger, as we heard, recently announced that it's building a new facility there. We've got Red Bull. We've got Carvana. We also have Ball building in Cabarrus County. So, Fred, everyone wants to be here. Come on in. The secret is out. Yeah. And the jobs are much needed. Yeah, we Absolutely. need the impacts. Yeah.